what's meant for you will actually happen. And this is actually um, a really powerful state of consciousness to be into. The consciousness of trusting, okay? Now, I believe that the universe works in perfect ways. And sometimes we feel that we want to disconnect from this trust because certain experiences lower our confidence. But what I'm realizing is the fact that what's meant to happen will happen. What is meant for us will actually happen. And today's message is about making you guys realize that you can actually trust the universe. You can trust the process. And even if sometimes it feels like you are experiencing negative things, those things are still a lesson for you. Those things are the things that need to happen for your soul's best evolution. Now, I also want to speak about responsibility and how we're actually creating our own experiences, okay? So by the principle of vibration and correspondence, we understand that our energy actually attracts into our lives our experiences. Now, these experiences are lessons and these experiences have the purpose for us to actually raise our vibration, to learn a new mindset, to learn a new perspective of life. And even if it feels like sometimes it's negative, it's still a positive lesson, okay? So everything that is happening is happening in a perfect way. It is a choice that we have made at a soul level. And our job as conscious beings is to actually extract the lesson of each experience, okay? Extract the lesson of each experience. And I'm realizing that there is the consciousness of the alchemist where <clears throat> the alchemist turns his negative experiences into his favor okay so he realizes that he needs to accept himself in the process he realizes that everything that is happening is actually not happening to him but more likely it is an opportunity for his soul's best evolution so when you go through life and when you gain the spiritual maturity, you realize that it's about acceptance. It's about also about letting go. It's about trusting yourself and loving yourself unconditionally. So if you really want to step into the process where you are realizing that everything that is happening is happening for you, you gotta love yourself in the process. You gotta have a healthy mindset. You gotta have a healthy perception. And you have to realize that you always have the opportunity to transform your life, okay? You always have the opportunity to make the best out of the worst. And in essence, what I believe to happen is the fact that we are the co-creators of our own experiences, okay? It means that our energy, our vibration, our state of consciousness, they actually attract everything into our own lives. Our job as spiritual beings is to raise this vibration, to raise this frequency, to change the mindset so we can attract a, so we can attract a higher vibrational experience, okay? So in essence, what you are experiencing is in resonance with what you are feeling and what you are thinking and also with what you are doing, okay? So the more that you master your soul is the more that you realize that you have the opportunity to attract into your life higher vibrational things. You have the opportunity to really make the best out of the worst, okay? Now, I also want to speak about letting go and about the fact that we shouldn't be attached to our experiences, okay? You have to realize that in this process, everything that you need is already found within yourself. It is already found in your state of being okay so maybe it's not even about the achievement it's more likely about who you are becoming in the process okay so realize that the secret is already in your state of beingness the secret is within yourself and the more that you master what is happening within yourself is the more that you master what is happening outside of yourself okay so realize that in this process you don't have to be perfect okay you have to really accept also your imperfections and you have to love yourself unconditionally and you have to know that what is meant for you will actually happen into your own life 
So you have to realize that every single experience that you are experiencing, it is actually a lesson. It is something that you are agreeing upon at a soul level in order for your soul's best evolution. Okay, so <clears throat> my suggestion is don't be in resistance to your experiences. Instead, begin extracting the lessons of your own experiences. That is how to go about it. I believe that it's all happening in a mathematical way. It's all happening in divine order and in divine timing. And whatever you are experiencing is what needs to happen because you have to learn something out of it, okay? So realize, guys, that in this process, you are the co-creator of your own reality. And the more that you begin to master your inner world, is the more that you will begin to master this reality as well, okay? So it's all happening for you. And I believe that the more conscious we become, is the more that we are connected to the quantum realms, is the more that we are connected to the intelligence of the universe, is the more that we are connected to the flow of life, okay? So the universe works in perfect way. And what I'm seeing in my own self is the fact that the more that I'm raising my consciousness, my energy, is the more that I have the opportunity to let go and step into a more harmonious state of consciousness, step into a state of consciousness where I'm beginning to work in relationship with vibrational alignment, okay? Vibrational alignment is nothing more than being connected to the vibration of love, of peace, of harmony, okay? So it all starts with your inner world. The more that you make peace with your inner world is the more that you make peace with your own life. The more that you find inner peace is the more that you will actually attract higher vibrational things into your own life. So it's all about taking responsibility for what is happening inside of yourself, okay? That is the secret. Go within yourself and get to master yourself and get to express yourself from the inside out, okay? So when you relax in the process, you realize that you don't have to be attached to the outcome. You don't have to be attached to certain experiences. Instead, you have to take full responsibility for your own inner world and get to evolve your soul from the inside out, okay? The secret is within yourself. And what I'm realizing is the fact that the only suffering that we have is attachment. And we may be, uh, we may be attached to the past. We may be attached to the outcome. We may be attached to certain experiences in our own lives. But the more that we begin to let go and the more that we begin to trust the divine timing of the universe is the more that we will find a wider and more conscious state of beingness, okay? So my suggestion is make peace with your state of beingness and see what happens. Because the secret is in the state of beingness. We are human beings, okay? When you make peace with your state of beingness, you help the world expand at a more harmonious level, okay? So in essence, it's all connected to you. It's all connected to your state of consciousness. My suggestion is let go and trust the universe, okay? What's meant for you will actually happen. Now, this doesn't mean that you don't have to step into action. This doesn't mean that you don't have to take responsibility for your own life. It means that you are now at peace and you are content with everything that you have into your own life so someone said the only way to get more is to accept whatever is right now so accept the present moment accept your experiences accept where you are finding yourself in life and you will see how the universe will actually need to give you more because whatever you are a vibrational match to, that is what you will actually experience. Okay, so realize that the universe works in perfect ways and nothing would happen without the universe's permission. It means that when you are trusting the universe, you're actually in vibrational alignment with everything into your own life. And you have the power, you have the opportunity 
to attract abundance. You have the opportunity to be in alignment with what needs to happen. You have the opportunity to co-create the reality that you want to experience. But it all starts with inner peace. It all starts with letting go of the attachment that you have towards life. It all starts with healing yourself and evolving yourself at a harmonious level. Okay, so remember the universe never gives you more than you can handle and the universe works in your favor. The universe always works in divine timing and wherever you are finding yourself right now in life is where you need to be. Trust that everything that is happening is happening in your favor and you will see magic happen. Connect more to your inner being, to your higher vibrational nature and you will see how you can begin to trust the universe at a more harmonious level. Okay guys, so this was this message about making you guys realize that what needs to happen will actually happen. And everything that is happening into your own life is happening exactly as it is meant to happen. But you gotta become aware of it. You gotta acknowledge it at a soul level. You gotta be in alignment with what you want, okay? So thanks so much for watching and if you're new to my YouTube channel, feel free to subscribe, leave a comment and if you wish to work with me on a one-on-one -on -one level, feel free to contact me at my email address in the description below. I love you so much guys and like always, see you on what is coming up next. Trust yourself, trust the universe and also take responsibility for your own life because in essence, you are the co-creator of your own experiences. I love you so much. Namaste to everybody and see you on what is coming up next. Bye-bye.